and gents and welcome back to my channel it's your girl Shane Fash Fab for those who are new welcome thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button and that button to watch my video and for my existing subscribers you know I love you all just the same thank you all for your love con continued support and continued support anyhow so today I'm back with this another beauty hack video with a regime because for the last week or two weeks I've been uploading videos on healthy skin because I'm all about that now and this video is basically going to be on what I do to cover my pores before I apply my makeup because some of us suffer from that large pores like myself guilty victim here and my pores are so freaking large that sometimes if you're up close in my face you can actually see it but then this is a regime that I've been practicing and I find that it it doesn't really help it a hundred percent but I find that it helped it a bit of 70 to 80 percent so I'm still trying to research and try and see if I can find something that can just cover these freaking large pores you know so I thought I would come on camera and share it with you guys today and thought I would help as my sisters out or my brothers out who are interested in seeing how you cover these pores so yeah I really hope that you guys like this video and please give it a thumbs up and please do not forget to like comment subscribe and share my video and I will see you in the next one so let's get right okay, into guys so the first tool. thing I'm going in here is my Smashbox oil-free primer and I'm applying that to my skin and the reason why I use this primer first is because it has a smooth base consistency that I completely love. So once I apply this and well as the first stage then the foundation and everything will go over pretty much smoothly. The next primer that I'm going in which is the key is to always use a pore primer a primer that substitute only two pores. So I'm using the Smashbox pores primer and as you guys can see I'm doing like a finger roll motion here even though it's going fast but I'm doing a finger roll motion just ensuring that the gaps in my skin from my acne scarrings are actually filled because I have large pores and I'm just ensuring that I'm filling those pores along with the acne scarrings so the next item I'm going in is my going in with is my corrector and I'm using the cover fx corrector in the shade brick the reason I'm using a corrector for this one is because I have acne scarrings, as you can see, which are my dark pigmentations. And the key tool that you need here is a brush, well, a thick consistency brush. And this one is just an elf brush that it's used for contour. The foundation that I'm using today is my Makeup Forever foundation. And I'm just ensuring that I'm rubbing that in, ensuring that the pores are filled with foundation and don't worry guys i mean once you remove this makeup at night you just have to make sure that you know all that gunk is out of your skin which i have a facial video on here of products that i use to take care of my skin it's on my channel the so i'm here i'm just you know applying the foundation and as you guys can see the holes are actually not there like they're less or minimal visible so the next item I'm going in with is my Laura Mercier Deep from, um, Setting Powder and I completely love this powder. The reason why I'm applying this before I apply the foundation it's because you know you have to try and modify that foundation to lock in all the stuff that you used before. And I just love this powder, guys. This powder is like from the gods, like beats from the gods. Like this is so amazing. I totally love it. So there you are. I'm just examining to ensure that, you know, the pores are covered. And you guys can see. I'm showing you here a little close up. So what do you guys think? Please leave a message down below and let me show you the finished look. Thanks for watching.